little statement, two questions. Uh, just disappointed because we, we, we were bad tonight. You know, credit Iowa. Uh, congratulations on the victory. We were bad. Um, you know, we lost to Cincinnati by one, Gonzaga by two. But we competed the right way in those two games. And, and I didn't. We, we were second half, we, we, were, we were good. You look at their percentage second half. But we lost that game in the first half, giving up 44 points. I mean, we made great growth defensively. Um, <coughs> We, we, were, we were bad in the first half tonight, and it affected both all areas of the game. Um, you know, when we're playing a certain way, we're really good, I think. Uh, but we have to play that, that way consistently. Steve, they went on a 10-0 run, I think, midway through the first half. What did you see that allowed them to Transition. do that? Transition. Transition. Go look at all the baskets. It's the way they're, they're run with, that's the main way they score, him or Jock, that or Jock. That's their main two weapons. Transition, 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 transition. We talked about it. Um, we didn't do a great job getting back. I mean, they shot layups, uncontested layups. And then they had a couple, you know, Dom hit a three, Jock kind of hit that one, um, kind of clanked in. You know, he's a really good player, you know, so he may make some of those. But chart their points in the first half out of the 44. How many did they get in the half court offense? 20? Maybe? You guys missed. And we missed a I'm ton sorry, of bunnies, right? A dozen layups. Yeah. I was say a dozen I mean, layups. Too. We got it what to seven, we got it to eight. I don't know. You know, and that's the thing is we don't want to have the guy you're just gonna throw it in there. We've got to score a little bit differently and off drives and kickouts, but those plays we gotta finish. Because when you get it to seven, you know, even the first half it happened where we got it at seven or nine and it was missed layup, missed layup. <clears throat> Second half, same thing. We just missed some bunnies and we need all those. When you're not, when we're not, weren't locked in defensively like we were in the first half. Because uh, second half, our second half defense was good enough to win. The way we played in the second half, it was good enough to win. But the last, then we started having to press the last two minutes and, and do some things that because we're down. But um, you know, you know, we have a thin margin. But like I said, when we're, you know, Coach Calhoun talked to our team today, he watches play, he watches play a bunch. And, we have to play a certain way. We have to play with great pace. We have to play with great spacing. We have to play with great ball movement. Uh, that's when we're really good. Why did those things disappear, the spacing, the ball movement, I mean, the they, I the they came out and really tried to pressure and, and get after us a little bit. And, and I think we you know, took a, seat, a step back. Um, but I mean, you look at it. We, we got ball movement. The first play is 3 nothing. We finally hit a 1-5, to five and they make a hustle play, block our shot. Um, but again, chart those first. 20 points. How many did you get in the half court? Maybe maybe two? You know, you got to be good transition defense to be a good defensive team. And this team has to be good defensively. Do you ever feel like you guys got into a rhythm offensively? Um, in the second half, I mean, we were good, but we were pressing a little bit. But we got it to seven. I say pressing, not full court pressing, but pressing to, you know, push the tempo a little bit. But, um, you know, we missed some. I mean, I, go out, I bet you watch the game. I bet we missed a ton of bunnies just that, that deflate you a little bit. Um, or free throws or second chances, um, you know. You know that was that was that was frustrating because we did have it to, you know, we had a game plan to get it down and we did great. To about the first eight, first twelve minutes, of the second half, we were perfect. We were right on schedule. We get it to eight, we were eight or nine, and then we went through one little bad slump and they kind of got it back up to fourteen. That really that really hurt us. Steve, you have a, a roster of good shooters and it doesn't seem like you guys are at times shoot, shooting particularly well. Is is it just the variance of, of playing? It, like, what do you think that is? I, mean, I just I got to keep looking at it. Um, I think we're missing some that you hopefully you make. Obviously, I think they're pressed out on our shooters because that's that is our strength. Um, and then we got to probably screen better and move the ball a little bit better. Um, you know, uh, but we haven't we haven't we haven't done a good job shooting from from three, especially. Is this team still cons- trying to get used to playing without George? I wouldn't say getting used to playing out with, without George, but I would say just trying to figure out the best. I would think collectively just trying to figure out the best way for us to continue to be effective. Um, pace of play, you know, half court offense, and guys knowing you know a couple of big possessions, you may call certain things. Everybody's got to know it and execute it, you know. And so, um, you know, last year's team is last year's team. So I mean, and George is George. You know? Who is that go-to guy this year? You know, I think it, it, it changes. I think Deontay can be it. You know, when he's really effective, I think Monte can be it. And as in that, I mean, I think we've got the thing with this team is different.